Leo, what is up? It's your girl, Kat. We're going to do your weekly love reading right now. It's going to be just focused on love. I'm doing something a little bit differently. I have five decks of Oracle cards out, and I'm going to pull an Oracle card from each deck, and then I'm going to pull some tarot cards, and we're going to put it all together. <laughs> I already shuffled these ahead of time, but I like to do it again just to give it a little. The energy of right now, not five minutes ago. <laughs> right. I hope everybody is doing good today. All right, let's get it started. So we're going to start with the Romance Angel Oracle cards. Getting to know each other. That's so funny. I just shuffled that. And I think um, Gemini just had that. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So it could be new love coming towards you. Somebody new to getting to know. It's exciting. Okay. Girl with a snake. Charmed or used. Enable boundaries. Okay, so be very careful because this could be somebody who's very charming. Okay, uh, kind of like deceptive nature there. Could be a little narcissistic, little, you know, selfish, very charming person. Be careful. That one jumped. <laughs> All right. I do care for you deeply, but I'm scared you want too much. All right. So I feel like this is a new love. It's somebody you're just getting to know. Uh, I feel like you need to be careful because you're being warned here that there's somebody with a snake. You could be charmed or used. You need to enable boundaries. And it says here, I do care for you deeply, but I'm scared you want too much. So possibly this person, um, you know, wants something different than you do new love embrace an opportunity for love in your work prospects for or for spiritual growth embrace an opportunity for love in your work prospects or for spiritual growth so for some of you could be meeting this person at work or you know at church or something but i think that what they're trying to say is a different types of love to embrace but yeah so you could be meeting this person at work or at church something like that i don't know but i don't know this girl with the snake is bugging me out i don't like that i feel like you need to be careful and the fact that we're getting that I do care for you, but I'm scared you want too much. It seems like somebody who's going to be non-committal. I don't like that. Only time will tell. I know. All right. So I feel like, I don't know. Let's pull a couple of cards. I wouldn't be surprised if we got the seven of swords, you guys. The sneaky mofo. Because I'm not feeling this. I have a bit like a, like a apprehensive kind of like cautious energy. Like I'm looking at this person kind of funny. So, um, Leo, I think it's important that you be super, super cautious and, you know, um, don't let you down your guard too early, I feel like, with this person. Yeah, this is somebody who's very sexy and attractive, has a lot of admirers, gets a lot of attention. I feel like it's somebody who really knows how to get what they want. Somebody who celebrates parties a lot, goes out with family and friends possibly. Hanging on. Hmm. Yeah, enable boundaries because I feel like this is somebody who's going to like try to hang on to you and maybe spend your money. Yeah, you're going to have to set boundaries. Like I said, enable boundaries. You're going to really have to stick up for yourself and, and set boundaries with this person because I feel like they're going to see what they can get away with with you. This 
So this person is possibly a little deceptive, a little selfish maybe. Moving out of hard times into karma waters. Yeah, kind of impulsive and reckless there. Very emotional. So I feel like, honestly, I'm feeling like they they even may even have like a little bit of a... Um, like an issue like a, like a um what am i trying to say <sighs> like some mental health issues like depression bipolar you know something like that i feel like they're kind of what's the word i'm trying to say non-committal kind of wishy-washy you know um, not really sure what they want, a little bit reckless and impulsive and very emotional. So I feel like just be very careful with this person. A lot of love there though. I think you have a lot of feelings for them. Be careful. <laughs> be careful. They could also be involved in legal issues here. Yeah, I think this person's just kind of messy. Leo, just be careful. All right, yeah, that's what I have for you this week. Um, I hope that you like that. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, I would love it if you hit that button and join the little Scorpio Cat family. The more, the merrier. Um, so that's your love reading for this week. So until next time, take care.